my goal in the course is to get students to un to read text as interpretation. And um, it's it's what I did before the pandemic. It's what I'll do after the pandemic. And actually having them go through the text together, looking for an argument, uh, looking for an interpretation is really, really important. And and the best students will always, you know, the quick, their students will get that immediately, but there are other students for whom it takes a, a, a really long time. And this is a way of speeding, speeding up the process because they see the other students uh, engaging in that kind of, of discussion. I mean, the other thing I'd say um, is that uh, in my fourth year course on the Soviet Union and the Second World War, I have a mix of students who've had some Soviet history before and students who have had no Soviet history before and some students who are real military buffs so they know all sorts of things that that I don't even know. And what what's fabulous is that the students who've had haven't had Soviet history can say what's that and then without having me to come in as the authority uh, another student who's had some has some familiarity can jump in and say, "Well, that's what it is." Or somebody could just even look it up from Wikipedia and put in a, a, a definition. And um, so, so that's a whole different dimension of of what they get to do that would be lost uh, in a in a in the face to face of a classroom. So by the time they we get to discuss this as a whole group together in a seminar. Um, they've already done quite a bit of learning 